The human race machine takes your picture and shows what you would look like in six different races. It can truly turn curiosity into an education. You're just going to put your chin up over here and then look up at the screen. Look up. Should I move it all? No, you're good. Perfect. Okay, now I'm just going to map out your features. So Dave, what do you consider yourself? Like what race? Caucasian. Caucasian, so white, right? Yeah, white, white. Okay, so in this machine, what it's going to do, it's going to morph your face with the stereotypical features mm -hmm. of each of these races. But since race is like a socially constructed thing, there's no like genetics for it, it's just, it's just going to be like a stereotypical image. Okay. So Asian is the first one. <laughs> <laughs> so here, like your features, are your nose, and, yeah, yeah. wide and nose, and your cheekbones also change, but then your lips stay exactly the same. I have big your, lips. Yeah, your features mm. with the stereotypical black image fits, and then this is white. Huh. So that's weird. It looks different, also. Yeah, some of your features doesn't fit in with the stereotypical white image. As someone who's working the race machine. Seeing people go through it has been really, really interesting because you can almost like see the questions form in their mind. I was surprised how similar they were, with the exception of some of them, the lips changed. But other than that, it looked a lot like how I look now. It can definitely be educational in that way because it's hard to get past the skin tone to see, oh, that person is a lot like me.